Hey guys, welcome back. Yoshimori Moto. Yoshi Speed 405 goodbye. Uh, today, got up early this morning, went to Walmart, had to pick up some groceries, went to Mega Disc Replay, and been up all night on whatnot. And people were like asking for these Twisted Metal games for PS. Well, I found one and two. Spent $54 on them. So, Twist Metal 1 was greatest hits. That was uh, $29.99. So, with the 7% sales tax, it was like $33 in some cents. Then, um, then I got Twist Metal 2 for $19.99, which, you know, those are at like the deals or whatever for them um that's kind of what they go for on ebay but this non-scratched works great had them test them out it's got it's complete in box so in the cases and whatnot it's not the long cases it's just the small cases long form cases are actually the exclusives uh they're worth actually more money but it's twisted metal um, then last night I got a sealed copy of NFL Street for $55. That's tax and ship. Then got another Luigi Ma or Luigi Mansions for the 3DS. So that's complete in box as well. For like was, I paid 13 say I think $25 and so I'll sell that for $39.99 on eBay I'll sell the I'll have to get my Kings at the VGA or WADA it's got a small tear on it but it should should bring bring value even if it's like a, a six or a seven it'll bring good value um, because there's only a couple copies that I've seen uh, WADA or whatnot, and they go for like 1500 to 1700 so I'll wait the 30 weeks for that and get that back. Um, then I bought a couple of uh, 77 action figures. Um, so I got Stormtrooper. I'm missing the gun for that, so one of those guns is like $25 and it's like this big but again send that in to WADA if, it, if this is like extreme white I'll send that in because that's a grand I think I picked that up for like nine bucks so but if I have to buy the, the, the stormtrooper gun for that and make sure it's the correct gear then um that's probably going to be like an additional 40 or 50 dollars for that little piece so you know i'll be into it for all for like maybe 200 bucks uh that's for the acrylic case the plating on this thing and whatnot so um then Um, then I got a couple another I got like another Star Star Wars action figure it's a green guy and that's and again from one of the base sets base 12 or whatever it is so you know and I got that I got that one for like maybe 6 or 7 bucks and then I got another action figure I don't know what it's got a helmet on and so I got that for like a buck sixty or something like that. So, so yeah. Um. Then I got another game, kind of paid a little high for, but again, it's like one of those sought-after games that you know. 
once I get my brand established, it will, it's going to pay a high dividend, I think, because that's what people are looking for, so. So we'll go from there, see what happens. Not a, not a big deal. If I don't sell it, I don't sell it. As simple as that. But I'll get my my followers that I need and go from there. Uh, but like I said, I applied for uh, whatnot. I said there'll be like two weeks, so I need to grab as many followers as I possibly can. So far, I got like 17 followers. Um, was a room monitor. Um, then I had a person try to report me for, you know, sticking up for somebody. And uh, I'm just coming here and whatnot, and they were complaining about something being too high in price. I was like, it's the seller's price and whatnot and the guy goes you know i reported them and whatnot i was like well you can't just report them because they telling you that the price is high you go on ebay and you go on certain other websites the only thing that makes this thing worth anything is if it works that's about it and you know but they wanted like 80 bucks for a ds light which I think it was like 40 bucks everywhere else. I mean, I I haven't seen a DS Lite go for more than 40 bucks in a long time. They just don't sell. Now, like, I, I had a DSi sell for 100 bucks. But that's the internet version. But the, um, if it had its, like, case and, and charger and whatnot, I mean, yeah, maybe, maybe 100 bucks. Maybe 200 bucks, but like not 80 bucks in crappy form. But you know, this person, I think their name's Chicken Bug, um, went into like 10 or 12 different rooms last night asking for DS games. And then like they bundle it up for these people or for this person. And then they fucking just leave. Excuse my French. And, you know, these people are trying to make a living, okay? They probably, this is the only job they probably have. I get it, okay? I'm not complaining about certain things. I mean, I haven't said, you know, I've got a DS and whatnot that, you know, is worth $600. And people complain about that. And, you know, if I get reported for saying it like that, that's BS, I'm not in their room to I'm not in their room to sell anything, and the one that um, was uh, allowing me to talk and and whatnot made me a moderator, and and I'm trying to help him out as as best as possible. Last night, and I was up until like two ten in the morning helping this guy out, trying to make money. Um, and his name's Insane. And the reason why I did that is because, you know, there's a lot of people that are trying to make it. And i rather just help them last night. It's kind of like give a, a, a give back, you know. Because, you know, he's probably going to do the same thing to me if, I've, if I ever needed it, you know. He's not one of those people that are out for themselves. To, he's out actually out for everyone else, you know. Help them out grow and establish and stuff like that, you know. He even told me come by his place and chill. And you you don't ever get that from from other people or the bigger corporations because all they want is your money. This this guy's like, man, you sound chill, you know. You know he don't know my voice or anything like that. And you know, I was like, so I gave him a follow. He followed me back, and he's got, like, five other people that are part of the Insane's group. But they weren't with him last night when he was doing the sale and stuff. So, it is what it is. I, uh, and then met a couple cool people in there. But, like, like I said, this chicken bug came in, 
and was just like all over the place and you just can't do that to people like because they got they got their own show they got their program they're live streaming they're they're trying to do what they need to do I gotta turn the air back on they're trying to do their their thing and you can't just cluster them now uh, I went in there there was only three people in the room I seen I don't know what it was that Mario or that Luigi Mansion game I've sold it on eBay and it was like a two-day turnaround so if that guy sends it out today I get it on Monday Tuesday Tuesday I'll get it out on Tuesday and I put it up on my eBay and it probably sell in like three days. Um, if, if when I get that, like I said, that uh, NFL Street, um, that'll be uh, that'll be like a forty-week turnaround. So you guys won't even see that for a while. Um, my Def Jam uh, Vendetta. Uh, it's not the New York. But that was another banger that I bought. And I think that was what I was talking about was like, that was a little high in price. What I bought it for, cause it was like $30 plus like $8 shipping or some shit like that. So like, I didn't really, I'm not gonna make any money on that, to be honest with you. Even if, even if I put it up on eBay for like $55, no one's gonna buy that for 55. I'd be surprised they do, but, um, but yeah, this is one of those things, but that's a complete inbox Dev Jam Vendetta. Uh, now the sealed versions of those, they go up from like 13, 14, $1,500. Now the New York edition of that actually is like almost like two or $3,000 sealed and they go for like $200, well, hundred dollars loose and like two, two fifty, you know, complete the box. Sure, I've seen one that wasn't even. That says that it's non-working, and it was. It they sold it for like one seventy-five. It's just a name. So, but, and then, then today I bought some twisted metal games at a premium. But that was at the Mega Disc Replay, which I hate doing because they sell it above market price. But if it, if I get into whatnot again, you know that would be a banger in one of my in my things. Um, so I'm trying to plan ahead and and trying to get a lot of different things. But I really need a win. So, like, if... Yeah. I don't know. But... It is what it is. So, I, I've been trying to find PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5 games. I've been trying to find Switch games. I'm trying to find all sorts of games. There's another one. It's called The Takeover. I really want to get that game. And the limited edition run, the long paper copy, but they want like two hundred and forty dollars everywhere, and it's a hundred and forty nine dollar edition game, limited run of like eight thousand copies. And I want to try to find like a hundred or or two hundred, and then send that in the water. But someone's already got those and they saved it. Or like even the, the number one production, like that's like the gem, the holy grail. And someone probably got, oh, I got number one and probably opened it up. Thinking the box is worth more money. I don't know. Crazy things happen. But it just, it's crazy. So, 
So that's the thing about today. And the new $1 bill is a $20 bill. Just throwing that out there. The new $1 bill is a $20 bill. Something that's worth $1 is worth 20 That's inflation, my friends. But, uh... So, yeah. <clears throat> that's... That's the thing. So... But... <clears throat> I wanna... Wanna find some deals and whatnot. So, that's what I'm gonna do. So... It's a uh, uh, priority to get my whatnot. I'm going to get my LLC. And then uh, I'm going to be streaming at night. Hopefully. Be great. Be a good start. So. All right. Well, I'm at work. I'm chilling. So you guys have a good day. And thanks for enjoying my little rant. All right.